Okay guys, so today I just want to uh, recommend this thing called the Air Duster from Apolar, uh, I guess. I mean, it doesn't matter what brand. In general, these are... I mean, it's amazing. Reason why? Because um, Air Duster, mainly a lot of times, like back in the days, I always buy the canisters and then you would spray and then within like a couple of, I must say 20, 30 seconds, it starts getting really cold and then it's really hard to hold on. And then I, and then it's, it's kind of annoying because then after a while you just keep on trashing it and it doesn't really last that much. And then it's about, I must say three cans, about 12 bucks. I mean, it, it's very relatively, it's very powerful, but I felt like it's not, it's not very green. That, that's one thing. And then, um, and then it's, I just hated the fact that after a while, it, it just becomes really cold and it, it float like the, the whole can like freeze up and then you just, you just have to put it aside and wait a little bit, then you could use it again. And then by then, you know, um, you know, and then the, the power of, of the duster, it gets weaker and weaker as, you know, as you just keep going. So I, I was doing some research to see what's the alternative and I came across these guys. And then if you see, look over Amazon, a lot of time they're like 60 to $70. I, I think the price is a bit steep. And I found this on eBay, which is $39.99, 40 bucks. But yeah, yeah, but the only um, negative thing about buying from eBay nowadays compared to Amazon, it's like everyone's so spoiled. You get your stuff in two days or one day. But eBay, it takes like five to seven days. So this thing is the air duster. It's rechargeable, portable, strong airflow, eco-friendly. Okay, so let's see what does this thing comes with. So you get your... You get two nozzles. And then they have um, like a connector on the bottom. And you... So I guess I, I, I don't know the point of this. It's really dumb. Uh, I guess it's when you don't use it, you can just put it aside just like that. And it has an instruction manual, yeah, doesn't matter to me, it's pretty straightforward. This, I mean, obviously, this is a brush, and this is, I think these are like anti static brush or whatever. And then this, they both just blow, so this would be the stronger one for because of the, the taper head. So you just blow directly into the keyboard. The only thing not good because this is just a blower, you know. Um, so obviously when you blow stuff around, like if you open up your computer, blow like the dust will be all over. Then you, it comes with, um, that's where the motor is. You have your regular USB charger, not USB-C, just regular. So on the back, it also tells you the input Voltage is 5 volts, input current to a output power of 40 watts. Um, then the battery is 6,000 amp. So to use this guy is pretty simple. You just press and hold. Or you could tap it twice. And then just blow. And press it again to shut it. And press it again to shut it off. It's a quick test. I don't know if you see it, but here's like look at all these dust. It's great because you see how long I was blowing the for air duster, like the canister one. There's no way I could blow that long. I mean, I could still go on. It's very strong. I don't know if you can see it from this way. All right, let's try. You know. Funko Pops. You know how big these guys are. So yeah. So it's pretty strong. And then this one, uh, you don't really need to test. I mean, I wish it, <laughs> it also does suck, but it doesn't, it just blows. You can brush and blow at the same time. It comes in handy out. Um, based on like let's say your surface has a lot of like dust and then you just want to brush it off and then 
but then you know then you brush and then blow it's gonna cause a lot of a lot of dust flying around that's the negative about it so yeah this is like the aftermath of after the blow so you see all these dust and I still have power in you I mean it's so now my keyboard is amazingly clean nice Ooh. after a full charge is able to blow I mean right now it's 32 minutes already oh okay so I'm extremely impressed so after a full charge I'm able to com continuously blow for 32 minutes okay so here's my take this is pretty good I mean for Forty dollars is a bit steep, but make sure don't get the one that's seventy dollars. I mean, there's better ones out there, but I think this is more than enough. If you prefer the three can versions, it's roughly about twelve dollars for three cans, and then it, it lasts you. I must say, from my experience, every can lasts me per computer. In a way, like you, you want to blow out all the dust from your CPU fins, uh, all the fans. Um, in general, I, I think may, maybe a can will last for twice, but this one, you know, 30, 30 minutes, that's amazing. Um, so that's my take, $40, and it'll last you a long time, um, $12, three cans, I don't know, you can do the math, I mean, if you just want to do a quick blow, you know, either, either one is fine, I need to stop saying that, it doesn't sound right, but anyway, I recommend this, if you get it, if you can find it cheaper, it's the best. Uh, if you can't, mm. but I know a lot of people, you know, can is more than enough, $12, or if you buy a pack of six, maybe 24 still doesn't hit the $40 price range, but I think it's eco-friendly and it's, um, on the long run, it's, you know, you, you probably save a bit more, but yeah, so the only major issue I have with this guy is the three hour charging time, but you get 30 minutes of you know, blowing the dust out. To me, it doesn't bother me, the, the noise. I mean, it's close to a vacuum cleaner sound, I must say. But, you know, you, you uh, how long are you gonna use this? You know, at max five minutes to get rid of all the dust. So, yeah, I hope this video could help you, you know, decide if you, you need this or not. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.